Good morning, good morning. So today is Mother's Day, so happy Mother's Day to all the mothers. I am in Panama City Beach for Mother's Day. We came on Friday night, stayed at a Hilton property, I think it was Hampton Inn or something like that. And then Saturday we got, we came closer to the beach. We weren't too far from the beach then either, but like, I mean, Friday night, but we just figured, you know, why waste the money? So we are at the um, Embassy Suites by Hilton. This hotel is like seven days old. Uh, don't quote me on that. It could be maybe eight, but it's probably no more than 10. So um, seven days old, brand new hotel. It's beautiful, um, aesthetically. It's very, very nice. I'm just gonna walk on the outside of the hotel just to kind of give you um, an aerial view from the ground. <laughs> See, Cause that's not really an aerial view, right? But anyway, so this is outside, this is the beach. So we're right there. Like we can see the waves hitting the sand. Like it's across the street, but the walk is literally nothing. So that's an A plus right there. Um, because you pay more, like technically you pay more to just be on the beach. It's, it's, it's a few hotels like that that are actually on the beach. I don't know what that hotel is. And there's another one down there. A couple years back, we uh, stayed at the Holiday Inn, which was on the beach. Very beautiful. Also inspired us to come back to BCB. So um, this is not necessarily on the beach, but they might as well have said it was because it's literally across the street. Traffic stops when you're... Um, when you're about to walk across the street. So you usually get a lot of, um, you know, courtesy from the uh, from drivers and cars and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. It looks like there's some parking over there too. So let me, okay, speaking of parking. So this hotel is valet parking only. I'm gonna I'm a tell you, it does not need to be valet parking. They, they really need to probably come up with another method. Because if you think about it, you're paying $22 for valet parking. And then every time you are, um, you know, you go in or out, you have to, you know, you have to tip. I mean, at least I do. Like, you know what I mean? So who has cash? Like, all the time. So that that's a lot. That's a big much. Especially if you're traveling with a family, you got your kids. Like we came, it's me, and my husband, and our youngest child, um, Mason. So we, it's like we, we're we're in and out quite a bit. It's some places that we would walk to probably if it was just us. But with him, we're like, oh, he's gonna get tired on the way back. What want want whatever. So we chose to like drive certain places. And then there's just, this is the South. So there's simply just places you have to drive to. Um, last night was a perfect example. We wanted to go, they have this place. It's like a snow cone place. Um, it's, a, in, it's a New Orleans inspired type of place. This is some back entrances to the pool area. I don't know if my key card will work, but that's not my plan to go in there right now. Anyway, I'm gonna come in through the side door so I can show you guys the inside and then the pool area. But yeah, so um, it was a New Orleans inspired um, place. They have like snow cones and beignets, some other stuff, but they closed at eight o'clock. And when we found out that they closed at eight o'clock, it was like 7.40. <laughs> so we had to come back we, we were walking down Pier Park, which is an area that we're very, this is very, right next to, which you would absolutely love. So again, another A plus on location because it's right near Pier Park, the nice piers right there. People are already out fishing. So yeah, so we couldn't get there in time enough because by the time we had to go to Valet and get our car and get, through the little bit of traffic because this gets busy at night let me tell you they um the traffic if you've ever been to vegas it's like that 
Vegas traffic, but it's only for a certain amount of time. Like it doesn't last forever, but <laughs> it's lit out here on um, in the evenings. I hope my finger's not covering the speaker when I talk because I don't know that it is and I don't think I can redo this. <laughs> so we're leaving today, by the way. So I, I told my husband, he's like, oh, we definitely got to review this hotel. And I was like, yeah, because we could not find out one review on YouTube. So hopefully we could get up there first. Kudos to us for being the first ones. Um, I can't. I got so much to tell y'all about this hotel that y'all would not believe. So this is Pier Park area. And it's like a long walk down there, but I'm not going down there. We might try to go down there later. Maybe that'll be another video. Because um, we're not like heading out right now to go home. But, you know, anyway. So, <clears throat> yeah, so the, we were number one. This, this hotel is brand, brand new. Beautiful. It's, you can tell it's baby. Like, look at the palm trees. They're babies. They're not even grown in yet. Um, the grass is still being nurtured and stuff like that. So, for the culture, you'll see, like we saw yesterday. Well, I don't know if my husband was outside when I saw him, but for the culture, uh, people were out, landscapers were out um, working the grounds <laughs> and like checking things out. There's some parking back here, but this is Pier Park parking. So, I don't know. If you're staying in the hotel, if you could park over here, but that's a really good question because let me tell you that valet, I just don't think it's worth it. Like, I think that they should make this entrance that I'm about to walk through. It's like a it's to the parking area, they should make that area like one of those key cards you didn't use your key card for your room, you should be able to use that to come into this gate over here. Let's see. So they see this gate? We should be able to do that. Um, because it just seems like a little bit ridiculous that you have to pay $22 for somebody to park you in this very large parking lot, might I add. And I've never seen it full. So it's not like your valet parking to control parking because there's tons of parking. And if you're trying to control parking from the people that are visiting Pier Park, then you use the gate with the gate key and allow guests to um, walk in through there. So, seems a little crazy, but we're going to go inside. I'm going in through this back area. Funny story, me and my son yesterday got lost coming through this door here trying to go to get our keys, to, trying to get the car. We didn't know what to do, but then we figured it out. And you could go straight to Pier Park right here. So another A plus, location, location, location. There's the Ferris well. That was our view. We didn't get a good view. We didn't get a water view, but we'll, um, we'll show you a video of the room. It's very nice, very nice room. Um, they made very good use of the space. Look, they got my husband. <laughs> He's doing the same thing I'm doing, just without words. So, inside we go.